In this session, we are going to inspect commits from the history view. I have a sampled project which is downloaded from GitHub. To inspect the commits, let me right click on the project, go to team and click on show in history. So in the history view, what we can see there are different sections. This is the commit draft section, this is the revision comment area and this is the revision details area. Now in the commit graph area as we can see it shows the history of all the commits and it's in a reverse chronological order meaning the latest change is at the top and the older versions are later on. And if I see this commit graph area what it shows it shows commits their IDs the commit message author author date committer and committed date. Few things to notice over here in each and every commit it has certain color coding uh, say for example when it is showing the local branches as you can see it's with a green rectangle the remote branches it is showing with a kind of gray rectangle and the head reference it's totally white now for tags it's showing yellowish rectangles so it has its own color coding to uh, distinguish between different types of branches or tags etc. Now in the revision comment area we can see the commit ID is shown the entire commit ID author name committer parent branches etc and the commit message. Now on the revision details area we have the files which are associated to the commit. Now if I click any of these files and if I scroll down in the revision comment area it shows the difference like what line is added. Let me select another file. So it shows me like what is the change that is actually made. So from here I can double click on this file and then the specific version to the commit will open. So here the historical state of the file I can also check. But another good way to view the commit is using commit viewer. Let me right click on a particular commit. On the top click open in commit viewer. So here you can see if I double click it shows the commit ID, the author, the commit message, the files. So this is the commit tab over here and if I click the difference then it shows like what are the changes that has been made. So this is a proper readable option to view the commit details. Now let me open a commit which has file changes for two files and let me open it in commit viewer. So right click open in commit viewer. Let me maximize it by double clicking. So here it shows the commit message, the files that are changed and here you can perform multiple operations like creating a tag or create a branch etc. So that is not our focus at this point of time. So we have two files. If I click on difference, the nice thing is for both the files or all the files associated to that commit, it will show you what are the changes that are made. Now let me close this. We can select these two commits and right click and select compare with each other. So this is one view where the Eclipse editor shows you the difference between the files on the left hand side and the right hand side between these two commits. Another option is right click compare with each other in tree. So this is a tree compare on the lower part. If I expand this we can see what are the differences. I can double click on the file. Now apart from comparing two commits we can perform other operations from this history. Now apart from this comparison we can perform many other operations from the history view. Let me go back. So here in the history view we have the option for search. We can use the filter section for the history view as well. Let me provide a particular filter, maybe say merge. So as you can see, if I type in, it highlights the commit messages 
which has merge now we can configure this uh, filtering here if I click on this see right now it is searching based on comments I can select it to all or what we can do we can search by a particular ID as well so if I click the ID and I can search with this particular ID 3796A8F so let me just provide 8F only so as you can see over here this one is highlighted so in this way this filter option is pretty handy another nice thing about this particular filter is say for example I change this to comments and I change this search value as merge so from here suppose this is only selected merge pull request now we can go to previous or next in the search criteria so at times that is pretty helpful rather than scrolling down to different places so we can click this next or previous button and accordingly those comments would be shown so overall this history view has multiple features and those are very handy whenever we are inspecting the comments